The Prime Minister confident his leadership's not in danger, despite a group of his own MPs wanting him to step down. I want to see something happen to give us a chance to win the next election. Liberal MP Ken McDonald told Radio Canada he signed a letter calling on Justin Trudeau to go and personally knows up to 18 other Liberal MPs who signed it too. Didn't say anything about a threat, it was just that we'd like to see a change in leadership. It's the largest internal revolt Trudeau's faced during his nine years in power. The vast majority of MPs, in my view, uh, strongly support the Prime Minister. Cabinet met for longer than usual and presented a united front. Any minute spent on this garbage is a minute that's not spent on, on, on Pierre Polyev and what he wants to do to this country and I think that's very dangerous. This all unfolding on the eve of what could be a showdown with caucus. It's a moment where caucus is going to express itself, the Prime Minister is going to listen and we're going to get through this as a team. MPs will have a chance to share concerns. What it will be is, I hope, a good airing of the issues as we see it. At caucus, we have in-camera chats. If we have problems, we discuss them. The opposition using it all to fuel its attacks against the government. It is being eaten from inside and being attacked from outside and nothing is happening. The whole story now is what will Justin Trudeau, superstar, do. The reality is he can't administer the government because he's too busy fighting for his job. Sources working to oust the Prime Minister say the plan is to ask Trudeau to step down at that caucus meeting, telling him how many members want him gone, but not naming names. Ashley Burke, CBC News, Ottawa.